as the snow starts to add up across the state, Iowans are having some mixed feelings about this weather. KCCI's Ophelia <laughs> Jacobson live for us tonight in Osceola. And Ophelia, not only is there a lot of snow, but it's actually getting pretty windy out there too. Yeah, Ben Stacy, we've been here in Osceola since about four o'clock this afternoon. The wind is definitely picking up and the snow is getting it's snowing even harder now. Um, I would say there's about two inches of snow on the ground right now and the snow is pretty heavy and wet, but perfect conditions to be making oh, making a snowball. Uh, but as you said, not everyone has the same reactions when it comes to this type of weather. Snow, you either love it. I'm excited about it because I get to go around shoveling snow. Or you hate it. <laughs> I don't like snow, no, but we need it really bad, so that's what it is. I hate the snow. However people in the city of Osceola feel about it, there's no escaping the storm. The city is under a snow ordinance until 5 p.m. Wednesday. I take the dog for a walk because we're both bored. <laughs> Jennifer Holtry walked her dog Astro Monday night in the town square. Both were bundled up in their coats and shared the same feelings about the weather. He's not really a winter dog because he just sits there and shivers and shakes. Others braved the cold to run errands at the store. Shopping at Dollar General. Not letting the snow put a damper on their regular routine. As long as you walk and you don't just stand still, you don't get too cold. Snow plows were also out and about already clearing the streets and de-icing the pavement ahead of even more snowfall expected overnight. The city could see between six to nine inches of snow through Tuesday midday. And some see that snowfall as an opportunity to get outside. Kids are happy to have the snow and go out and play tomorrow. And others a chance to bunker down. I don't want to come back out in this. And we just saw two plows going that way. Snow plows have been circling this town center this afternoon and going into the evening, making sure that the roads are clear for people to drive on and de-icing that pavement. And just as a reminder, if you are out and about tonight, make sure to slow down and use caution as you're driving on those roads. Live in Osceola, Ophelia Jacobson, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's news leader. Okay, Ophelia, thank you. Did you hear that guy say he likes to shovel snow? First time I've heard that. <laughs> <laughs> well, travel could be treacherous this evening, and it could only get worse as we head into the overnight hours. This is a live look at the roads across central Iowa right now. These views are from cameras monitored by the Iowa Department of Transportation. The roads are slick, so please make sure to take it slow if you have to be out on them tonight.